Daryl Brooks is questioning this young lady and it's a short um, cross-examination because he wouldn't stop asking about um, the state of Wisconsin and that bull crap. But let's just watch it. Stated that you saw uh, brake lights. Would that be fair to say? Mm-hmm. Was that a yes? Yes. Thank you. Would it be fair to say you would only see brake lights from a vehicle if it was attempting to stop? Or slow? So, just so I'm clear on that, you would see brake lights on a vehicle that is attempting to slow down or stop? Sure. And you stated that um, you can estimate the speed of the vehicle? I estimated 20 miles per hour. And would you characterize that as extremely fast? For, yes, for the parade, yes. How did you come to the conclusion of the speed? With how quickly it went from point A to point B in my range of sight. So, dummy, duh, Rel Brooks, you didn't want to ask any more questions about the speed, huh? Uh, going back to the gas station uh, incident, um, you were, I, I would, I guess I would need to see the map again. We you still were, have that available? The map? We still have the map with the markings available, or was it cleared after we captured it? I didn't clear it. Yeah, okay. Can we please um, save that as 7B, please, Your Honor? It will be saved as 7B. <clears throat> and admitted... Any position on that, Mr. Brooks? Um, I, yeah, I don't, I don't see the relevancy of the map. It's directly related to our testimony, sir. It's relevant. Your objection is noted. So It's overruled. Exhibit 7B is received. Uh, where were you positioned again at the stoplight? I was in the front row in the middle lane. Do you remember if uh, it was a car to your right? I think there was a car to my right. Do you recall if the uh, vehicle you saw going into the gas station had any tinted windows? I do not. You stated that you were pretty sure it was only one occupant of that vehicle? Yes, that's all I could see. With all you can see, or are you sure that it was only one occupant? I could see one person. So it would be fair to say that you couldn't see any other seats in the vehicle? I saw one person when it was head to head with the vehicle next to me. The one with the arms. Trying to like take her words and make them favorable to him, you know, as to like stepping on the brake, slowing or stopping, and then whether she's seen more than one person in the vehicle. And if you ask me after he asked about the slowing or stopping with the brake lights, Look at the look on his face and his hand movement. It's like he was trying to intimidate her. Now, I'm not saying that's exactly what he was doing. This is just my opinion, so don't get your undies in a bunch, y'all. But 
I just, every time a woman is up there, it seems as though he tries to, you know, intimidate her by either standing and asking the questions or hand movements and facial uh, expressions and stuff like that. In the air, and then I saw one person as he stuck his head out the window once he pulled in. Could you see the passenger seat? I could not from could that you, point. Could you see the back seats? No. Do you recall uh, who subpoenaed you here to testify? Yes. You stated for the record? Yes, I said. Oh, you, the state of Wisconsin district attorney. Do you see the state of Wisconsin president in the courtroom today? Objection, irrelevant. Sustained. Mr. Brooks, move on. Under 906.11, I've sustained all of the objections related to this line of questioning. It's not relevant. Next topic, or I will find that the cross-examination by you is done. So you're, you're sustaining every question pertaining to that part of questioning, or is it for yes. every testimony? This right here, he's looking at her and knowing exactly what he's gonna ask after she said this, and he did, and the outcome was what she said it was going to be? It's on that topic, so you may continue if you choose another topic. Have you ever seen the plaintiff state of Wisconsin before? Right, pursuant to 90611, um, judge controls the order and mode of interrogation that these questions uh, violate sub one and Mr. Brooks will not be able to ask any further questions of this witness. Does the state have any redirect? No redirect, Your Honor. All right, thank you. You may step down. This was a short cross-examination because the judge actually nipped it in the bud. I'm surprised about that. Uh, and I'm glad she didn't have to deal with him any more than she did, you know. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And like I um, have said, the subscriber shout-out will be after this. Check the description to find how you can help. The link is in the description how you can help my channel. Thank you very much, y'all.